What's going on, everyone? Welcome back. I hope everybody's having a great day. Folks, I got a cool one for you. There was a gentleman, I think his name was David, who sent me this, what looks like a screenshot from a video. Now, this video is from Japan's Salim Luna Orbiter, and it's pretty interesting. What you see and what it really is, is two different things. First, I'm going to show you what he sent me, and then we're going to dive right into this thing. Let's just get into this. All right, here it is right here. You can see where this gentleman has circled three areas, okay? I'm not sure about this bottom one, although I see something right here. Not the whole lighted area, which I believe is from the sun, but you can see something right there. It almost looks like it's sticking out like a top of a square type thing. But interesting right there, you got a black dot right here. See that? Move up to this one, you got what looks like straight lines, straight areas. Okay. When you get up to this top area, I'm looking at this and you can see what looks like almost a square. But there's objects here or something. But what I find interesting is this whole white area appears to be ornate. This whole area looks like that. Folks, look at this. Blur. Blur at the top. Almost everywhere in this photo has been censored. Just this area alone looks ornate to me. This is not natural. You can see straight lines. Straight lines. Lines going this way. Lines going to the right and left. Everywhere you look, there's something here that doesn't look natural. Now, let me show you the original right here. Now, what I do is I waited for the video to play. Now, you can find this. It's actually a short, and it's from, uh, I believe it's Amazing Space, and I'll give you the link to it so you don't have to go searching for it. I let the short video play until I get up to this point. I see ornate. I see things that do not look natural. And I'm going to show you this right now because a couple things really caught my eye and made me really want to dive into this. So let me just jump out of that. Let's get into Photoshop. Okay, here it is right here. Zoom into this. Now, folks, right off the bat, I was looking at this. I'm going, okay. So I'm a little confused about the shadowing. Now, I see the shadow right here, right? It appears to be coming from the rim of a crater right here. You can see the crater. And it looks like where it's coming from. So I see that, but I'm going, what about the shadows right here? Now, obviously, the taller the object, the bigger the shadow, right? We get that. But this doesn't look like it's that far off the ground, folks. So the more I looked at this, it didn't look like natural stuff. Like this area here. See how they blurred that out? Okay. Appears to be coming out of here, straight into here, and then what looks like something else. Look at this corner right here, right there, and I'll remove this line in a moment, but check this out. Folks, what are we seeing here? What is going on? Let me remove the lines and check this whole area out. Even this piece right here, that's not natural. Blurred out. Blurred out. Just this whole photo, folks, has basically been blurred. Now, Here's another thing that caught my eye. This blurring out of this, what looks like this white area, goes right through this blur. Again, lines, lines. Actually, they're objects and intelligently made objects at that. Here's another thing that kind of blew my mind. As I looked at this, I told you about this shadow here. Now, if you were to take this off a moment, this being the higher level, medium level, lower level, Folks, this is not a shadow. This is a ledge, and you'll see this in a moment. Here's some more interesting features. Look at this right here. Look at this closely. Zoom into it a little bit. Check this out. And that's only from what I could see at first before doing any enhancements. There is something that does this. Okay? Now, look at this area. This I thought was interesting because... There's these three dots, at least right there, and then you got two more lighted areas, or at least lighter colored, if you will, meaning not dark, it's actually more of a gray. Look at the parts in here, folks. Look at the things. This does not look natural at all. Okay, let's back up a little bit. 
I notice something down here as well. You don't see it very well, but you will. Here. Bits and pieces, folks. All we can do is pull out little bits and pieces that's inside this sensor. Again, look at this. What is going on? What's with the blurring? Everywhere you look. This whole photo is like this. It's, it's a complete mess. So let's get into this. I'm going to show you what happens when you dive deep into this particular area right here. All right, so this is the enhanced photo, and now I'm going to do black and white view, folks. Now, again, we're looking at a multi-level civilization. Here, here. Folks, you can even see it up here in the top lines here. You can see where it looks like you can go under it, okay? Same thing applies here. You can see the shadow right here coming off of this area where this so-called crater is, and I don't believe it's a crater for a moment, but let's say that it is, still see the shadowing here, okay, from that particular area. This is a level, okay? Now, you can see the other structures over here, here, and here. Folks, nothing screams ornate like what I'm seeing right now. This is insane. This is awesome. Again, we're looking at these pieces right here. Look at the way this thing's like literally like boxed in kind of thing. Straight lines everywhere. This is completely blurred out. And I try to make heads or tails of that. Here. Now you can see something going on a little bit right here. You can peek through the censoring. You can see something going on. And I'm not sure what to make of it. Right there. But you can see what looks like something doing this. Some kind of piece right here, something sticking out. Okay. Piece of the white, that's the actual color of these objects. But look, they did everything they can to blur this out and just take it right out. And you can see that. Okay, let's back up. Okay, get into this a little bit more. Black and white it. You can see the difference right here. I'm trying to get rid of the colors because what's going on, as you can see, there's a line where either A, it's darker, or it's been more censored. And you can bet that's what's going on, right? Let's black and white it so we don't have that fooling our eyes. We'll slide over here. I'm seeing what look like structures everywhere, okay? Back out a little bit. Now I try to get into this a little bit more. Zoom in. You can see this right here. What look like walls instead of just a lunar surface, right? Right here. You can see it's got some height to it. Pieces that are going like this. Okay? Hidden right there. What is this right here at the end of this? Folks, I don't know what these are. These long, I don't know if they're just above ground transportation tubes. I'm not sure what they even make of that. I don't even know. But clearly to me, in my opinion, it's not natural. Again, this whole area. Let's keep going. So anything that was white, we try to bring in a little bit more. Okay, let's see what we got. Now, obviously, it's not going to be the clearest photo because we're not meant to see it. I find this really interesting the way these things are built. Look like two white orb type things. We got details doing this here, like small round darker circles. The way the shapes are in here, this doesn't look natural to me. None of this does. Now, it was a little difficult to get out because of blurring or something. And we could try to bring this out the best we can. So again, it's not going to look super clear. This area down here, which I just showed you earlier. Check that out. And folks, I didn't even do the whole photo. I did not even do the whole thing. There's much, much more in here. The good thing about this photo is when you back out, like this, you have a super bright side, a medium area, and a dark area. Obviously, you're not going to be able to pull out too much in that dark area. This is like the perfect area to bring out. Not too dark, not too light. 
you can bring out details a little bit better. This area to the right, mm, not so much. Pause it right here, have a look. Even up here, you can see what looks like a walled area, a higher level area, and this is a little bit lower, and this is higher. Notice you can see these ledges here, if you want to call it that. You can see literally going up like this. So clearly there's a wall, there's a higher elevation in this area, this lunar area. This, like this area here, that is a different level. Highest, medium level, and lowest. Have a look, folks, and drop your thoughts below. And folks, there you go. To me, when I saw that right off the bat, I went, wow, I'm seeing what looks like squared off areas. I'm seeing what looks like ornate. I don't see just natural. I see a lot of stuff that looks constructed. And like I said, being purely speculative, it looks like travel to these long areas or their structures connected to each other with a multi-level civilization there. Folks, as always, drop your comments down below. I want to hear what you got to say. Please like and share the video is always appreciated. And don't forget to give the video a thumbs up so that YouTube will share it. Folks, I do have more coming up. I told you guys I have a bunch of these to get out. I'm trying to balance the busy lifestyle with the videos. So I'm going to try to get these out more. You can see I'm just, you know, I think the last one was like seven or eight days ago. So I'm going to try to get these in closer together uh, because I got a lot of them to bring out. So stay tuned. Anyway, folks, thanks for watching. Always appreciated. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.